Hi, I'm Allie, and this is my husband, Justin. Over a year and a half ago, we decided to build out our own camper van in hopes to travel full time. After hitting the road in January, we found ourselves coming back home to fix some things and get in a better spot to be full time travelers. This week, we break out our tools as we prepare good old Coco to hit the road again. That took two seconds to clean under the bed. This is literally everything. The majority of what we own. Who knew? We're hoping if we take the water tank out, we'll be able to look up close and see if we can fix it. All right. Now, how do I take the water tank out? So I think all the hoses are off now. I just got to get those straps taken off. Let's do it! I'll see if I can pull it out the back, because that would be easier. Oh, the water is spilling. It's pouring out. Can you go get oh, the towel, please? Towel, 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 towel. And then grab that gray towel and tell it to me. I had a feeling that might happen, but I was hoping it wouldn't. Maybe not the most planned out idea. <laughs> Empty your water tank before you take it out, kids. Uh, Help me All out. right, stick your legs out. I think if you look right there, there's like a hole in the threads. And yeah, it's like the threads are split all the way up right there. You see that? You just crack. I don't know if I can fix this. What do you think? I don't know, man. You want to do something easier? Yeah. Got some replacement water cartridges for our filter. Hopefully that'll be easy, right? <laughs> Definitely easier. We honestly love this filter. It filters out all that like hosey smelling water. If you want it, we'll link it below. Cool. That is definitely a lot easier. So now what? The backup radio? Camera? Oh, the backup camera. This isn't something we talked about a lot because it's like such a luxury to have a backup camera on your van, but the day we officially left, our backup camera stopped working. So it's been a luxury we had, but wasn't working. And so we're excited to see if we can get it back. Uh, I was hoping there would be more slack on this cord that I could pull it out some, but there's not. Let's see if I can do this. Well, no luck. Fudge. So we could take these screws out, but then we'd have to take this piece off, and this piece is nailed in. Oh, is there any other way we could get in there? I'm hardcore lacking motivation for this right now. You gonna work on the radio? I'll try to figure this out. No. I don't want you to tear it up back here and me not be aware. 
we're going to think about this a little bit over some food before we make a big decision whether to take off our back finishing piece. Thank you. Now that we're all filled up, we decided we're going to try one last thing with the backup camera. So let's give it a shot. Doesn't work. That's it. It's not worth the trouble. So yeah. let's do it. Three, two, one. We're back and we're ready to get this camera working. We came up with a new idea, like Justin said. His dad actually, he has all the gadgets, but it's like a little camera on a, on a string or th something. And you hook it up to a phone and you can put it in tight areas to see what's in that area. So we just want to see if there's a wire bundle somewhere. If not, we're just not going to have a backup camera. Are you seeing anything? It's so funny. Can I see? Oh, that's all you can see. It's all the wool. Alright, I guess I will get it buttoned back up. Well, we've made it this far with that one, so. Cutting it. No backup camera for us. Maybe we'll get one of those mirrors that mail trucks have. We're calling it quits on the backup camera, but I did just want to start the car and see if anything happens. Who knows, maybe we did something. Work, you mother trucker! Work! Wanna do the radio? Yes, please. And it's a blown! Woohoo! One left. I hope there's like a like a they might be giant CD. <gasps> what? <laughs> we have a win, guys. <laughs> what? Eric, Eric Church. Church. <laughs> Who's Eric Church? Yeah, it's country music. Let's play a song. We don't have a backup camera, we don't have a working transmission, we currently are no water, but we've got radio, we've got music. That's awesome. <laughs> Fix the radio. Check. Get the water filters and replace them. You want to cross that one? If we didn't mention, this ginormous list is everything we need to do before we get back on the road. Which, hopefully, is in a couple of weeks. It's a lot of stuff to do. But there's three things cut off it, so not really important things, but who's looking at that? So we've been thinking, there's so much space under the bed. I mean, crazy amount of space under the bed, but that 40 gallon water tank kind of takes it all up. Mm. After doing a little bit of research, we found you can get a 30 gallon tank that mounts to the underside of the van, similar to how we have the gray water tank. Mm -hmm. So if you have any experience with an undermounted freshwater tank, comment below, let us know how you like it. Or 30 gallons in general, if you have less than 40 gallons of water that mm -hmm. you're going by, let us know how, how long does it last you usually do you like it? Do you wish you had more? Do you wish you had less? Whatever, let us know, because we're, we're curious. So with that all being said, we have a lot of thinking to do. So we're gonna wrap up the video here. If you liked this video, please give it a giant thumbs up. It really supports our channel. We do have a buy me a gluten-free cookie account, so if you want, click the link below, buy us a gluten-free cookie. We love cookies. <laughs> Hit subscribe, because we post every Sunday, so. We'll see you guys then. Bye. Oh my gosh, I just found the cutest shirt. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. <laughs> what?